and girls, your Green Devils are back in the friendly confines of Burley Stadium tonight. Tonight's opponent from Morristown, the East Hurricanes. say he was knocked out of bounds. I thought the pylon was part of the end zone. Evidently not in Greenville tonight. Abracadabra. <laughs> of time. Oh! Poor decision. Nice! Oh, you rarely see that in high school.
sloppy second half here by the Green Devils. It looks like they've just gone through the motions. Well, let's see. Where do we start, Green Devil faithful? In the first half, the Devils looked like they were off and running and pretty much going to rout the Hurricanes. 28 to nothing lead at halftime. Uh, they were stopped just a couple of yards short of another score before the end of the first half as the clock ran out. They come out in the second half. Oh, they looked flat. Very lackluster second half for the offense. Greenville gets the win. A 35 to seven win. You know, people will look at that score and say, wow, you know, the Green Devils put it on them. And they did. But the coaching staff was not happy and rightfully so. A lot of penalties in the game, two turnovers in the game. Just a lot of fixable and correctable things tonight that if they do against some other teams down the road might cost them a win. Or, you know, in the playoffs could cost them a shot at a state title. But let's not jump off of the wagon yet, Green Devil fans. Let's not drive our cars into a block wall just yet. This team is still in good shape. EVD Big Gamers Desmond Dabs, the Magic Man. That's what I'm going to call you from now on, Desmond, the Magic Man. Because all we have to do is go Abra Kadabra, and he makes something magical happen. The kid is a beast. 200 and let's see, 30 yards, I think, tonight carrying the ball, four touchdowns. Uh, kudos also to Donovan Barner, Dabs' backup, if you want to call him a backup. He carried the ball for 107 yards tonight. Uh, not the best night of the year for the freshman quarterback, Cade Ballard, but hey, his team got the W, so that's all that matters. Next week, Another East, a conference foe, Sullivan East, undefeated Sullivan East, up in Sullivan County. The Green Devils hit the road for first place in the NEC. We'll see you there. Have a great weekend, everyone, and go Devils.